kind of awesome too. It is Wild Wednesday. Alyssa with the Dallas Zoo is here in the studio. Who'd you bring with you? So this here is Dulce, and Dulce is our spectacled owl. Yeah. So what's the difference between a spectacled owl and like a barn owl and some of the others? So the reason he gets the name spectacled is if he actually turns back around and you take a look at his face, he's got those big rings around his eyes. Right. So it's like he's got his spectacles or his glasses on all the time. Um, but he's going to be hunting the same types of things: a lot of small mammals mm -hmm. and lizards and insects living up in the trees, nocturnal. So kind of similar, uh, but different habitat, Central you, and South America. Okay, that's what I was going to say. Where do you usually find them? Okay, and uh, also, uh, what, what they eat rodents and those kinds of things. Yeah, he's going to eat rodents, opossums, skunks. Yeah. They don't have a Ooh. very well developed sense of smell, if any at all. So those things that smell really gross that we don't eat a whole lot of around, yeah. good to have owls hanging out. You're saying he's like two years old, two and a half? About two and a half years old. And they live to be. Into their mid to late 30s. Wow. Yeah. So he's going to be around for a long time. Hopefully. This was hand raised, so he's tame and he's. He's good with humans and yep. kids. Yeah, he's been around humans since he was just born. Uh, the keepers who raised him did a great job of mothering him. We've had him at the zoo since he was about one month old, so tiny little cotton ball when we got him. Fantastic. Oh, let's talk a little bit about Science Day. Sure, yeah. Science Day is coming up on September 22nd. It's ExxonMobil Science Day. We're going to be partnering up with a lot of our corporate sponsors. A lot of our uh, neighborhood sponsors are going to be coming out for science-based activities. They're all free. They're included with your admission. So if you come on out to the zoo, lots of exciting projects for you to Work on. And of course, at the Dallas Zoo, you have that baby gorilla. Tell us about the baby gorilla fa the family. Oh, Sam Beely and her family are doing great. She is super cute, and our members are welcome to see them uh, September 10th through the 16th. We're open an hour early just for members to head okay. to the gorilla habitat. So, special access if you're a member. Exactly. All right, sounds good. Thanks for joining us for CBS 11 News, the ones for Texas.